Alright guys, here's a little something, a little movement tech that you've all been sitting on in Rogue. It's the G-Slide. Literally, everybody at high level, everybody I know high level so far, knows how to G-Slide. It's pretty simple, and uh, I'm pretty sure it's not going to work for default. It's going to work. It will work for default configuration, but it's kind of harder to work for de default configuration. I have my dodge roll set to my r3 which is like my right stick in so i can just press in my right stick and instantly dodge roll but for default the dodge roll is your circle which is my crouch i kind of swap them because i find it more annoying to crouch when i'm switching you know sorters and stuff it's, it's pretty annoying when you just roll anyway the easiest method of g sliding is like the only method of g sliding which is Hit a ledge that's pretty high, which is mid, like mid body or higher body, but not so high like this. This is a very high body. You can't G slide off of this. But if you hit it like a little chest, chest height to like uh, shoulder height to knee height, you can hit a G, G slide. I'm not so sure if you can hit it here. We're gonna try after that. Anyway, you can just slide from here. You can just slide from here. Most of the obstacles, even on that, you can hit a G slide. Most of the obstacles on the game, you can hit a G slide if they're knee height or towards chest height. And here's the easy way how to hit a G slide. The moment you're gonna hit a G slide, you should be towards the edge or on the edge of an obstacle or jump on it, like jump onto the edge. As soon as you hit the edge, you're gonna hit your uh, right stick in. This is me, cause my dodge roll is inside my right stick. You're gonna hit the right stick in or whatever button you have binded to your dodge roll. You're gonna double tap it. Yeah, you're gonna double tap your dodge roll and change direction with your other stick. This is on controller. You can do it perfectly well on PC as well, but I'm not so sure if someone is gonna hit left control twice all the time. Anyway, here's a simple method of hitting a G slide. You can go one, two, and switch directions. I usually do it on the ship as practice, on the chairs, the sofas, whatever the things are called. You can hit it all the time there and practice your G slides before every game. Or you can just come to the shooting range and do the G slide like that. Then there is an extended G slide that pushes you away, which you can just hit. Same way, but pushes you forward. Just keep the direction moving forward if you have extra space past the obstacle like around here. And uh, that directional G slide can be useful, like if you're in a fighting situation and uh, you're being chased and you see an opportunity to hit the G slide, always take that chance. It'll push you further and it'll make less noise. What I mean by making less noise is I could come from here to there with a G slide and make a lot less noise than everything, than what I do when I'm walking. Here's an example if I'm walking from here to here, I take quite a few footsteps and I have auto sprint so it just turns on sprint anyway it takes a few footsteps and the footsteps are pretty loud but if I G slide here it reduces the footsteps I take that also works well or you can do another thing which is you G slide and you instantly jump it's gonna cut this whole distance by ha by a lot wait anyway, you can G slide and then you jump towards it as soon as you start sprinting here's what I'm trying to say like this then the moment you start sprinting, you jump like that. You have made significantly less noise and you've cut around 15 meters or 14. This whole space is just taken out and they barely can hear you. your enemies can barely hear you because you're taking less footsteps. Anyway, that's an application of uh, the G slide. You can also use G slide just for fun. If you're really bored, just roll around. I don't know if you can do it here. I'm gonna try it. No, you can't. Anyway, the G slide requirements are pretty easy all you have to do is double tap your uh, right your dodge roll button and uh, make sure you have a good platform to do it on because not everything works on G slide this works too on G slide and can also be used to disengage from opponents they're pushing you hard you can push back you want to push somebody you can push forward it's the same logic behind it and it's pretty useful I've seen nobody make a video of the G slide like literally nobody makes a video of the G slide it's so useful anyway if you enjoyed the video just leave a like I don't care if you subscribe you'll come back eventually let's mess it up